Hey guys, it's Zach. Today, I wanted to talk about a weapon that at one point was at the peak of Deep Vulcan's PvP meta, but upon the arrival of Verse 2, fell off pretty tragically, and has since lived up to its name. Today, I'll be talking about the Forgotten Gladius. Before we get started, I just wanted to say thank you all so much. We already made it to 1,000 subs. To commemorate this occasion, I'll be doing two giveaways. On this video, I'll be giving away a 3-star Enforcer's Axe to one lucky viewer. All you have to do is subscribe to the channel and leave a comment down below with the word Enforcer in it. I'll also be giving away a 2-star Legendary Weapon in my Discord, so make sure you join it, the link's in the description. Everyone remembers that at the height of Verse 1, the Forgotten Gladius was everywhere. A Tumanless Gladius and a Zerf Flames Gladius were extraordinarily popular, especially in Chime. You couldn't get through a few games without encountering one of these builds. So, why was this? Well, with a pre-nerf base damage of 18, scaling of 7, 10% pen, and swing speed of 0.8, it was heavily sought after for its mix of good damage and high swing speed. In a time when parrying and feinting, and weapon M1s in general were incredibly important in PvP, the high swing speed made this weapon the preferred choice of several top players, choosing it over the Shattered Katana. At the moment, not much has been changed about the weapon besides the swing speed being reduced to 0.78. This was a pretty substantial nerf, as the lower swing speed allowed it to be much more consistently parried. In the current meta of Deep Woken, the swing speed is still its greatest strength, but it is heavily outclassed in damage by weapons like the Alloyed Katana, Shattered, or Curse Blade. If the developers wanted to bring this weapon back into the current Deep Woken PvP meta, I would suggest a change to the critical. At the moment, the crit is just a standard critical found on the default sword or champions. A cool concept I believe could be a fun change to the weapon is a critical similar to the Darksteel Greatsword, except it's a single strike upward, similar to Marth's up smash in Smash Melee. You could give this critical hyper armor with decent damage and have the hitbox be only a small radius around the player. Not only would a new critical incentivize players to return to this older weapon, but it may end up actually being a pretty good timing mix-up, something that is highly sought after in a weapons toolkit. What do you guys think? Do you think a new critical for this weapon could be cool, and if so, what would you make the crit into? I'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments below. Like always, thank you so much for watching, and have a good one.